What's up everyone, Aaron Schatz back with you again for some more Free Space 2 Open. We are on the main campaign, I believe this is mission 14 or so. I think this is the fourth mission in Act 2. What are we waiting for? Let's get this started. I hear my enemies speculate about my motives, my ambitions. Who is Admiral Aiken Bosch? And what is that old scoundrel up to? The tragedy of my life is that I will be remembered as a butcher of innocence. And this assessment is not unfair. I cannot argue with their condemnation or with the verdict of history. The Neo-Terran Front is an army of stupid cattle, driven by their hatreds, their fears and insecurities. Ignorance is the greatest weapon of tyranny and old wounds open all too easily. I am merely a fool who created a monster I am now powerless to stop. And so I will play my role to the bloody end. I have given the lost generation something to die for. And now my legacy will be crowned with infamy. What my enemies will never understand is that my rebellion is about my love for humanity, not my hatred of Asudans. In the Gamma Draconis system, the destroyers have returned, and soon the Alliance will learn the method behind my madness. We have received news of an alarming development on the Civil War front. Massing his forces in the regular system, Admiral Bosch outmaneuvered the Colossus and its battle. Rebel Armada is now en route for the Gamma Draconis system via Polaris, Epsilon Pegasi, and Capella. Their final destination, Noso Subspace Portal. Allied forces destroyed a number of NTF warships as they ran our gauntlet of jump node blockades. However, rebels have sufficient firepower to threaten our positions in Gamma Draconis. The Colossus and its battle group are in close pursuit, neutralizing enemy stragglers. We must hold Gamma Draconis until these reinforcements arrive. The squadrons will assist with the blockade of the Capella node. As the Rebels begin their incursion, our objective will be to inflict as much damage as possible. The second phase will involve a counter-strike against enemy rallying positions, where the Rebels will gather to coordinate their final attack. We must diminish the NTF's offensive capability before our confrontation at the node. This campaign may prove to be the Admiral's final gambit. Whether or not Bosch reaches the portal, the NTF regime and this domination of Polaris, Regulus, and Sirius are effectively over. Command has disclosed neither the motives behind Bosch's actions nor the consequences should the Admiral succeed. Do you know? 18 months of carnage and terror will soon come to an end. The Aquitaine has just received four wings of the new GTB Artemis. The Alliance's next-generation light bomber. The most agile ship of its class, the Artemis will carry the Cyclops Torpedo, our modified anti-cruiser warhead. I have reassigned pilots to the 64th Raptors. This squadron will play a bomber and heavy assault role in the upcoming operation. Artemis will be armed with the new Prometheus cannon. Our nebula gas miners have gathered sufficient resources to resume production of the GTW-5 Prometheus S. The S-type is based on the original design of the Prometheus cannon. With high marks for shield and hull damage, the Prometheus was our weapon of choice in the Great War. I believe the S version of the Prometheus is the actual one that you will replace with the Subak. We'll see in a second, though. This is Commander Beckett, leader of the 64th Raptors Bomber Squadron. 
At 0457, NTF warships entered the Gamma Draconis system and engaged our blockade. So far, we've taken down the NTC Absalon, the NTC Canaxa, and several troop transports. Admiral Petrarch has called in the 64th to assist. The Vasudans are leading the blockade with the GVD Hedetet, a Typhon-class destroyer. The Alliance has also set up a network of five Mjolnir RBCs, or remote beam cannons. These unmanned experimental weapon platforms discharge anti-warship beams to complement the defense of a strategic target. The NTF fleet will enter through the Capella jump node. Each warship will then jump to a rallying point within the Gamma Draconis system. In the interval between jumps, they will re-energize their subspace drives. Your role will be to neutralize the warships with your Cyclops torpedoes. The Iceni has already slipped through our defenses, but we will make every effort to track Bosch down before the rebels rally their forces and attack. According to intelligence, the NTD Uhuru, the NTC Pax, the NTC Liberty, and the NTC Undaunted have entered the subspace node and are heading for the blockade. Well, let's see what we got to work with. All bombers, and it looks like uh, Beta Wing is uh, Space Superiority Wing. So, Alpha and Gamma are the bomber wings. Um, what do we got to work with? So, the Artemis, poor maneuverability, gun mounts, missile bangs, sure. I mean, See, the Artemis is what we're supposed to use, but, well, we'll use the Artemis for now. This sucks. We'll come back and fix this, but uh, basically what we, it's all bombers, and then Beta is a, uh, looks like a covering wing. Let's see what we got for weapons. All right, so we, it's only one gun mount. See, that's, I don't like that at all. However, look at the standard Prometheus cannon. So range is 1,500. A lot better. Uh, hull 77, shield 86, 30 inch subsystems. So let's see the Subak. 68, 53, 23, lower range. Now the Prometheus has higher power usage, however, it's better overall. I mean, you, we can outfit some Morning Stars as well, but everyone's got the same loadout, so Cyclops all around. Oh, we can put some EMPs on this too. Let's make sure that these are loaded up. Yep. What's this thing? EMP advanced, and this is a stiletto. So, we can use this stiletto to basically like damage subsystems like crazy. Um, and it might not be a bad idea actually to to load. These guys got Subox. Subox fire faster. So these uh this is fine. This is fine. And what's this? The hornets. Ugh. I'd rather have heart. Okay, can't have harpoons. Uh, what's this? Oh, we can have tag missiles? Might not be a bad idea, though, to do uh, a tag missile. I, I, I'd rather have... Um, this will damage subsystems, so if I can disable a ship, my buddies can actually take it out. I'd rather... I'd rather do this and have... Um, these guys take out. So this guy's got hornets and rock eyes. No, 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 no. Uh, the Myrmidon is unable to carry that too. All right, so and I don't get Tempest. Okay, that's freaking great. Wait, oh, it's Tempest right here. Hornets, Tempest. Okay, we don't want that many banks, of, so we'll put that there. Everyone gets Tempest. Everybody, just in case. Double Prometheus is on these guys, which is fine. This, fine. So I will be the only one with stilettos, but I'm gonna make Alpha 4 also have stiletto instead of a Cyclops. Should be okay. This might be, this might be a bad move. <laughs> That's okay. Um, all right, let's just, uh, here we go. 
try. Here we go. Sharp Alpha, NTF ships are headed your way. Okay. The NTD Uhuru is now in system. Take down that destroyer oh, and man. neutralize the escort. Affirmative, and it's incoming. Except for Alpha One, destroy Roger it, that, sir. Engaging your target. Everyone else, we should be okay. Let's see. This works. Yep, should be okay. There we go. Uh oh. Don't make it. 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 Come on, beams. There you go. Alright, should be okay. Good work, pilots. Don't smoke them yet. We've got more trouble on the way. Yes, sir. We'll take them down. Yeah, watch. Now they're getting caught in the black.
I die? How am I, how am I still getting hit? Holy shit. Everyone, Target kill fire. this guy! We've got company! Gamma is now in system. 2%, come on, kill him! You guys gotta be kidding me, you're not gonna kill him. We're gonna fail this mission again. There you go. The Perseverance is no more. That's what you five boys get paid for. I copy. Yes. Alpha Wing, return to base. Recon has located a rebel rallying point and we will reprioritize your unit. Not before these guys die. Take some stiletto action. Nice job, everybody. We did this mushroom. Woo! That was pretty awesome, though. Yeah! Everyone got destroyed. Rearming sequence aborted. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Excellent work, pilot. With our blockade of the Capella jump node, the Alliance has achieved a major victory. The Mjolnir RBCs and the bombing action of the 64th negated a significant component of the Rebel fleet. The Raptors neutralized all hostile warships that crossed our lines. No other squadron can make that claim. Our unit will be redeployed ASAP. Report to the Red Room on the double. For demonstrating exceptional skill in combat, you are hereby awarded the Distinguished Flying Cross. Wow, that was a... It's pretty tough. I think it took three times to actually get all the, uh, the ships. Now, obviously, I probably could have, you know, survived in the mid... The first one, I actually just got destroyed from ships exploding and blah, 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 blah. But, you know, whatever. We want the best possible ending. This was, this was it. So, remember, like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you in the next one.